Hey guys, Ty here, and in this video, we are going to go over installing Pavlov onto your Oculus Quest. It's a great first person shooter game. It's really good if you're into those sort of games. Definitely worth installing. But we're also gonna show you how to set your username in the game. I've seen a lot of players running around with the name Null. And this is gonna be a complete video for newbies. If you've just pulled your Quest out of a box, we're gonna take you from A to Z here. Uh, if you are an experienced user, we'll have links to kind of click through the stuff you already know. So let's jump into it. Tyco Tech. Tech reviews and tutorials. Okay, so the first thing that you're going to need to do as a new user is you're going to need to put your headset into developer mode. It's super simple. Click the link down below to go over uh, to Oculus Developer and it will ask you to log in. So log in using your email address or the Facebook account you used to set up your headset with. Then you're gonna see this, create new organization. You can type anything you want here. Nobody's gonna see it. You're never gonna see it again. So just type in whatever you want. Click I understand, click submit. You've read it, the terms and conditions, da 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 da. I agree, you're done there. Okay, next thing you're gonna need to do is you're gonna actually need to turn on developer mode and you're gonna use the app to do that. So uh, make sure your Quest is on and connected to Wi-Fi, make sure that you're phone is connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Make sure that Bluetooth is turned on your phone. Click on settings. Uh, you'll see your Oculus Quest there. You might have to click it to connect. Once it's connected, uh, come down to more settings and then fourth option down is developer mode. Click that and toggle it on. Then you can back out and you are good to go. Uh, now you're going to want your USB drivers. These are the drivers that allow the headset to communicate uh, with your PC. Go over to the USB driver link down below, uh, click you've agreed, click download, and then go to the folder where that has downloaded, uh, and uh, we've got it under ADB drivers, and then you're going to need to extract it. Make sure you extract it. Don't just double click it and open up that uh, zipped folder. You're going to want to extract it. You can click on it, and in Windows, uh, just go up to the top, extract, uh, and then extract all. I have a WinRAR, so I'm gonna right click it, and I'm going to select extract all. And then you're gonna have a folder, same title, go ahead and click in a couple of levels until you see Android underscore win USB. Right click that and then click install. Uh, your computer is gonna ask, do you want this uh, app to make changes to your PC? It won't show up in the casting here, but go ahead and click yes. Boom, you're good to go. If you're on Windows 7, you're going to need to install this using your device manager. We're not gonna go over that here, uh, but just look up YouTube. There's a ton of videos on it. It's really easy to do. Next thing you're gonna wanna do is plug your headset into your PC and you will get a little notification saying, do you want to allow a connection? Tick always allow and then click okay. All right, so now we're all set up. Let's get into actually installing uh, Pavlov here. So. Uh, Pavlov is going to come uh, zipped, so we're gonna extract it just like we did the USB drivers a moment ago. Go ahead and click on the folder it creates. First thing you're gonna wanna do is change your name. So you'll see a file called name.txt, or just name if you don't see your file extensions. Uh, open that up and put in whatever name you want, and then Control S or File Save, and then go ahead and close that out. That's gonna be your in-game player name. And then you're just going to double click Install Bat. It's super, super simple, and it takes a minute to install, uh, but just let it run through its paces and install. Uh, you will see uh, that it's successful when this window just automatically closes down. It doesn't seem like it's gives you, it doesn't give you any confirmation, but you're done. Then to play the game, just go to uh, your library. On the left-hand side, you will see unknown sources. And now you have Pavlov, and now you have a username. You're not gonna be known as null, like 80% of the other people playing in there. If you guys have any questions, run into any problems with it, let me know down in the comments below. I will also provide a link to the Pavlov Discord, where you can go to seek some help as well. There's gonna be people over there much more knowledgeable than myself. Uh, that's that. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. That really does help. Uh, subscribe to the channel. If you're not already, hit the uh, bell button to get notified when I do these videos. And that's that. I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks.